Hi guys, today I'm going to show you how to do this fashion inspired nail design. The inspiration comes from this Katy Perry and JJ Watt photo shoot. And for this one you'll need some nail vinyls, a thin art brush, and your polishes. The ones I've used are pictured here and will be listed below. So I've applied a clear base coat to my nail. I'm going to stick on one of these nail vinyls that's straight in a medium thickness and a thinner one. And then I'm going to apply some white polish to my nail and while that's still wet I'm going to remove those nail vinyls. Now I'm doing this design on my middle, my index, and my thumb. So I've applied that on all my nails and now I'm ready to start with the design. This is a time consuming design. I would suggest starting out with just doing one accent finger with this print if this is not something you're comfortable with and then that way it's not going to take you two days to um, get all your nails painted. So I'm just working with my thin art brush and I'm really taking my time. I have a movie on in the background and I'm just sketching in my shape. So I'm starting by creating this cross shape in the center. It's important not to put too much nail polish on your brush at a time or else it becomes very difficult to work with. So the other thing I did is because I did do three nails with the print on each hand, I wanted to make them all uniform. Usually I don't worry about that as much, but for this design that was something I was aiming for. So I'm just carefully sketching in the shapes that I want, switching back and forth between my colors so I've got a black, a beige, and the white base. The lines don't have to be perfect. This is a really small print. Now of course you're looking at a much zoomed in version, and remember your top coat's also going to smooth out your lines a little bit. Now I do apply this to my nail, clean up as I go, and I do go back in with a second coat where I really fine tune those edges. Now obviously a design like this is going to be a lot more difficult on your dominant hand, but with practice you'll get better and better at creating designs like this. You can also use tape as a guide to create all these little shapes. It's going to take a little bit longer because you will have to dry between steps. But on your dominant hand, you could always do a larger print just to make it a little bit easier. What I also like about this design is you can really change up the colors and get completely different looks. You don't have to leave the negative space in the center, um, or you could leave the negative space in a different spot on each of the nails. Really the options are endless. So I hope you'll share with me your recreations and hashtag Christabel Nails when you do. Here's a look at the finished product with the top coat. Thanks guys, I really hope you like this one. Please leave me some comments below, thumbs up, and new subscribers as always are so appreciated.